Hello, and we're back for more Kingdom Hearts 3 goodness. I'm very excited to keep going with this. Someone is shooting at me. Um, Alright, you want to fight? We can fight. I also really like the starlight. Like, it's pretty, like, visually attractive. I don't know. Did I miss all of them with that attack? Because I didn't have it locked on. Oh, that's on brand for me. I want the ice magic. Why does Donald get it before me? Probably because I chose balance instead of magic. But you know, we can't always make the right decision. I do actually feel like balance is the right one though. Were they just like running in circles? What is the point of these pedestals except that fight? Did they go all out on designing fights, but like not make those areas serve another purpose? That seems on brand for them. All these look like the trees in, S in Spyro. The area with the lions. Sunny Villa. I wish I could toast them. Why are they just sitting there? Like he's holding up the rock, get out from under it. time. Uh, water. Second time. Flip. Flip. Where's the other one? He's the last not B word on my list. Oh my gosh, they just keep throwing more at us. I don't know if these attacks are good at this point or bad because they take up a lot of time, but they're strong. Water up! Yes. I'm trying. My butt's on fire. We did it. Level five? Question mark. Get the people out. Okay. Get out, people. You have legs. Are you guys all right? You need hurry, to get to safety. Hurry. Go quickly. As Hercules was crushed to death that day. I just sipped tea, by the way. Sora had to live with the fact he didn't rescue. It's nothing. That's what these are for. Sora doesn't try it. Oh wow, very nice. Oh, Ooh. No organization. Your Zigbar. Nope. 
Ah, all this altruism is giving me the warm and fuzzies. So then, Sneak does break having a at heart of point? light come with an extremely good insurance policy? Just say what you mean. Oh, but I did though. No good will ever come from putting other people first. I was able to save Meg's life because I was ready to risk my own. He's like, I don't care about you, Hercules. You're you've just got a Disney character. Places, you mean. <laughs> Tricks like that don't fly for your average Joe. What do you know? You weren't even there. If you were, you'd admire Herc's courage. I don't admire one guy leaping into danger. He's like Stan Luna. Might have to jump in to save him. You're all just lining up to lose out. Dooming others to take the fall with you. Oh. And you can spare me the usual party line. Yes, hearts are powerful when they're connected. But if you put too It's like, yeah, that's that literally why we make Kingdom place, Hearts. Some of those hearts might end up breaking. Still, Sora, that doesn't mean you should change. Accept the power you're given. Find the hearts joined to yours. Hmm. Why would I ever take advice from you? Roxas? Lentis? You don't have any Shion? choice but to follow this sweet little trail of breadcrumbs. And at the end, you'll finally realize what destiny has in store for you. In fact, your reward might be right around the corner. You're so close! Give me the yellow eyes, way less <laughs> Chloe. <laughs> Hearts breaking. Whose hearts? Sora, don't let him bother you. He's just trying to get under your skin because he thinks he can. But we'll prove him wrong. We'll show him that our sacrifices haven't been for nothing. You're right. Mm -hmm. Besides, we're already proof enough. I understand why everyone's saying Sora needs chapstick. Yeah. What reward? That had almost the same energy as in Katamara Damacy when the little girl looks at you and she goes, I feel the cosmos. Uh, it goes through the cutscene and she stares into the camera and she's like, The cancer came scuttling back. So yummy. I completely forgot that the glowiness meant you could run on it. I feel so dumb. I hope I didn't miss stuff. Oh, shoot. I like that intense moment when he was dropping and like the winds flying in his hair and his ears. Do I want to jump down? I can't jump. Nope. Nope. Not there. While we're exploring, I actually have a story to share that follows my great deal of frustration. Remember last episode I said I can't drive? Well, that was the truth, because uh, I was making dinner, and uh, this was on, I don't know, like two days ago. Uh, okay. And, oh shoot, I don't understand how do I do it. Ugh. Hold on, hold on, I'll figure it out. Uh. Was making dinner. It was probably like 30, 40 minutes until the dinner was done. It was in the oven. And my dad is like, hey, go to the gas station and get gas before the price goes up. 
because you know you can get like alerts on your phone if the price is gonna go up. And I'm like, right now? He's like, yeah, uh, before dinner is out of the oven. And I'm like, okay, okay, fine. And I, I'm usually parked in the garage. He is not, but I am. So I have to back out a little bit, like past his car. And we don't have a huge driveway or a huge garage. So I went to back out, I opened the door, and I'm like, there's no room for me to back out. Because he's parked too close to the car. To my car. I'm like, okay, okay, maybe I can do this. I'll just, you know, be closer to the front yard. And I'm trying my best. Like, I tried to back out like four times. And... There's this hedge by the door, and I kept hitting the hedge, and I was like, okay, maybe I can just kind of plow through it, it's fine. Ooh, we're about to see a new thing, pirate ship. But, I thought I could just kind of scrape the bush a little bit, it'd be fine, we'd get through it. Nope, I get stuck in it, and I can't back out more. So I try to go forward, and then backward, and then forward, and backward, and forward, nice backward. Job, I can't boy. do it. <laughs> we checked the whole area. Hold on. It looks like everyone's safe. That's great. We did what great. we could. You heroes have been busy little bees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, look. More trouble. Why she got those skinny eyebrows? It's Hades. <laughs> Herc, let's go. Right. Okay. So, I'm struggling. I can't get out of the, my driveway. I would like go forward and I'd be so close to scraping the side of my car on the garage door and then I'd be so close to like getting out but I get stuck in the hedge and I went back and forth and back and forth like five or six times and finally I'm like you know what I'm not doing this <laughs> so I go back inside <laughs> I open the front door with my car like half stuck in the driveway and I'm like okay for real I'm like I would have been logical if I just been like, hey dad, your car is in the way, can you move it so it's like parked better? But no, I'm like, I like burst in as they're watching like Jeopardy and I'm like, can you back my car out for me? <laughs> and he's like, uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> and he comes outside and he's like, okay, um, why don't I just move my car? And I'm like, yeah, that makes sense. You should do that. So he moves his car. I'm like, okay. Okay, I can get out now. So I get to the gas station. And by now, it's a, a little less time than I thought I had. But I get to the gas station. And all of the pumps on the side that my door is, like the gas door, are taken up so I'm like all right I guess I'll just wait behind someone so I go to wait and ooh synthesis okay and I'm like all right whatever I'm waiting behind this guy in this truck and he has just started pumping the gas. And he does that thing where you can like hook your the thing on the handle so it keeps pumping and you can walk away from it even though you really shouldn't walk away from it. So he does that. He Oh, this is worse than Hmm. Oh, my food might be here. Ooh, okay. Uh, my, that was my dinner being delivered from DoorDash. This is not sponsored. Wish it was. But, uh, very excited about that. Anyway, 
I'm leaning behind this guy with a truck. And I'm like, are there, are there gonna be more Heartless that spawn if I walk around here? I really want to level up a little more. Probably not. So, I go and I sit there and he puts the pump in the in his gas tank and he walks away from it, goes and sits in his car and leaves it pumping and like five or ten minutes go by and I'm sitting in my car like starting to get really annoyed that I could have picked any other gas pump and I happen to pick this one where this guy's just sitting in his car with the gas pump in his truck knowing I'm behind him and it's like busy because it's dinner time and he's just sitting there and I'm like okay okay I'll just I'll keep waiting because I've already waited this long and finally he gets out of the truck and looks at the gas pump and you can tell he's like confused so I'm like okay what what is happening and he's still just kind of sitting there wait can I like Ooh, this is very fluid feeling anyway <laughs> he's just sitting there and he stops and he looks at the gas pump and he goes to pull the thing out of it and like, I don't know if the thing was still locked down, and it didn't pop out, and that's why he was confused, but in his head, like, nothing was like, maybe I should shut it off before I pull it, the gas thing out. So he dumps so much gas all over the ground, like, everywhere. And I'm like, oh god. <laughs> and there's an attendant, like, cleaning up the gas station, because it's like that time of day when they have to go around and take out all the trash. And it's this, like, younger girl. And he's standing there as she's walking by. And he stands there and looks at the gas pump. And then he goes and gets back in the truck. And I'm like, is he just going to drive away? Like, wh wh what is he doing? And he just back and forth just to the gas pump, to his car, to the gas pump, to his car. Like, he could not make up his mind. And <laughs> I was like, okay, okay, this is annoying. <laughs> but I'm like, okay. He calls the girl over, tells her that he spilled a bunch of gas everywhere, and she's like, uh, fine, okay. And she goes up to the window of my car, and I roll it down, and she goes, Hey, you can't use this gas pump because there's gas on the ground. And I'm like, yeah, I, I noticed. And she's like, you'll have to go to a different one. So I'm like, okay, okay. <laughs> I could do this. So drive around in a circle and go back to a different one and I sit behind a person again and I get I get my gas finally well I pull up to the pump and I realize that I haven't pulled up close enough so I have to start the car again go back and pull to, up to it again because the the tube on the gas pump was really short so I was like well this is it I'm just just a fool today I guess and <laughs> I finally got my gas in my car and I drive home again and I'm like okay dinner will be ready it'll be fine and it is but I pull back into the yard and I look and I've completely obliterated the hedge in the front yard like it's destroyed and I'm like, oh my god, my dad is going to be so mad that I destroyed this hedge. Because, <laughs> like, the yard is really well kept. <laughs> and I get in there and I'm like, I should just say it right now. So we sit down. The Jeopardy's over. It's Wheel of Fortune now. And I'm like, well, I destroyed the hedge. <laughs> and he's like, he's, he starts laughing at me. He's like, yeah, I saw. He's like, yeah. He's like, have you been drinking? And I'm like, no. <laughs> In my head, I'm like, God, I wish I had something to drink at this point. Because it was rough. And when I uh, was uh, with him yesterday, I left the room and then I came back. And <laughs> he was telling his co-worker about this because he thought it was very funny that I just destroyed this hedge I guess <laughs> so he saw it and was also like wow that is just ruined 
and they uh, now the I can't drive things will just continue endlessly because I can't drive. I also don't know how to get up this. Oh, maybe it's this path that's right here. So yeah, there's my story about how I can't drive. It was it's a good time. Yep, I've had many, many fun times driving. Uh, when I was in Cincinnati last summer, I drove the wrong way down a one-way street, and that was quite the adventure. A little horrifying. Um, it was okay. No one was hurt. <laughs> I have, I mean, I'm, I know how to drive. I just sometimes, it's really just like getting out of tight spaces and following directions that I can't do. So, that's always fun. Truly, truly just great all around when I'm in the car with someone and I'm like, well, I can't park right now for some reason. So, this is going to be painful for all of us. But, you know, sometimes it's alright. I love, I actually love the running up the wall. And I hopped and skipped over here. I wish I had the map for this part. I also don't know why they put that barrel there. Hmm. Hmm. More of these goddamn. I want to call them water blights, but that's the wrong game. Oh, the river thing was implying that the heartless were making it more full because they're water heartless. Oh, I understand now. Hmm. This shirt is pretty. Although I feel like uh, the Kingdom of Corona for with Rapunzel is gonna be a little bit similar. Cause it's again more like climbing, I assume. Unless I'm wrong. But I I mean they show in the trailer the part where they're like, ah, oh, look at this beautiful open field. Oh, there's a lot of heartless down there. Did we get him? Nice. I feel like there's something of worth to look at down here. Ooh. There's apples. I want those. Veal. Nice. A twilight shirt. See, like, that's so worth it. But when they take you into, like, that side room where you hit one chest and it's just nothing, really? I don't know. Ooh, like this. I'm just gonna open the chest. A potion. Oh, a ring. That's worth it. Oh, there's more. Hm. I'm just letting them fight while I find the treasure. <laughs> more teacups. What is that? Ooh, this is pretty. That's fun. Oh my gosh. But I can hit anyone. Can I just go flying in this? What? <laughs> this is dangerous. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose control of it. How do I? Okay. <laughs> that was fun. I like that stuff. What? 
What do you mean I can't? Oh. <laughs> I didn't have attack selected. Mm. Oh, for anyone who cares, the food I just got delivered is some honey walnut chicken and some edamame from a Chinese restaurant. I have not ordered from them before. Hoping it's good. I'm also very excited. It smells good. Um, we almost at the end? Okay, we're at the end. We'll watch this and then it'll be an episode, I think. This sure does feel awfully familiar. Yeah, just like before. Guys, this is getting worse by the minute. I hope I'm wrong, but my family may need me. Pick a side. Is that the plural of Pegasus? Is it Pegasus? Dora, I'm gonna fly ahead. You've been a big help. That's always a good idea. Leave the rest to me. Family? Yeah. Dad's king of the gods. Yeah. That's so what? weird that he calls him dad. <laughs> His father is a god. But doesn't that mean Herc is a god too? Oh, I think it does. Mm -hmm. Now, Micah, he's so strong. Then How are you okay? just figuring this out? Round two? No. Organization 13's here. He'll need our help. Good point. We gotta go. Cause he was never great. Hmm. I love that <sighs> they would consider oh, no, just being like, yeah, Herc's got Said this. It. I wanted to save her with all my heart. We fight with all our heart. Come on. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's a good place to leave this. Uh, if you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see where this goes. And I will see you guys next episode. Bye.